Charlotte Torrey was married to Montfell Cohen for almost 30 years until their divorce in July 2020. In March of that year, he was charged with aggravated identity theft and wire fraud. He was arrested for allegedly using one of his employees' personal information to rent an apartment in Timooning in 2019. The case was delayed over the past two years because Montvel Cohen had several medical emergencies, which eventually led to heart surgery, additional procedures, and cardiac rehabilitation. Eventually, in August of last year, Montvel Cohen agreed to plead guilty. On Monday, he asked that he be sentenced to time served with one year of home confinement as a condition of supervised release. According to court documents, his sentence would take into account his serious medical condition. His ex-wife, however, is asking the court not to show him leniency, stating he truly believes he can outsmart our justice system. In a six-page letter to the court, Tory cited multiple reasons and examples why he can't be trusted and how he misled her and their son. The lies were so extreme, she believes he lied and never had brain cancer, despite claims that he did between 2000 to 2015. Tory states he never let her accompany him to the hospital and never saw any hospital bills. What I do remember is only stories of how his doctors involved him in clinical trials, and that's why there were no bills to pay, she wrote. In search of healing from the years of deceit, she wrote that she conducted research on Evan's behavior and, quote, I've come to believe that Evan is a malignant narcissist psychopath. Tory states that he has been and remains a true danger to society. He is incapable of honesty, responsibility, true humility or remorse. I truly believe he is beyond rehabilitation. Montvel Cohen's mother also wrote a letter to the court asking that he receive a sentence that goes to the extent of the law and wants to make, quote, crystal clear that he has to stop his fraudulent behavior. She added, P.S., that I have dementia is yet another of Evans' falsehoods. Monvel Cohen was scheduled to be sentenced next week, but it was rescheduled to May 24th.